Welcome back. We are here looking at the energy market. And this is going to be my daily forecast for Wednesday, April 27, 2022. If you like support, channel, you want to hit the subscribe button down in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos. And uh, let's get to it. So W2I has a rally to 3.43% today. Quite a, a nice rally up towards the 50 moving average and then pull back. So we are getting close to a breakout here. We are basically pushing price action into this in this into this triangle. And at some point we are basically going to see this market uh, break out either to the upside or to the downside. It is it's basically it's just a matter of waiting. Um, you could make the case that prices should go higher due to the uh, continuation of the war in uh, in Eastern Europe. And you can also make the case that the world economy is doing horrible. China is basically shut down due to COVID. Their, uh, their economy is basically slowing down significantly. Um, US economy is not doing really good. European economy is doing horribly. And the forecast for world economy in general is also dismal. So that should create a lot of demand destruction and therefore these prices should drop last time we saw this um last time we saw this uh, higher prices and basically a world economy going into a real uh, recession prices basically fell off a cliff so i wouldn't be surprised if in a few months if it continues like this that we are looking at prices that are down at the 30 and 40 dollars uh, a barrel from we are where we are at this point but breaking to the upside we are going to find resistance here at 108 dollars and then roughly 115 116 dollars and then 120 dollars if we break to the downside here and then the then the previous highs here are roughly 84 and the 200 moving average at the 82 is going to be significant uh, support macd is basically flat on the signal line stochastic is bullish and the rsi is bullish as well so We'll see basically what happens tomorrow. So natural gas, natural gas, but basically all over the place today. This kind of market at this point has no idea where it's going to go. But there is, uh, if you look at the four hour chart, it's probably easier to, to see. So 50 moving average in the four hour chart or this area here is turning out to be very important for natural gas as we have tested it over and over and over again and been rejected. So getting past this barrier, which is roughly uh, from 6.957 to roughly 7.237. That's going to be a game changer for natural gas. Breaking above here, then we may see this go back towards $8 and beyond that. Breaking below here and below the previous lows here of 6.5, then we're tumbling towards the 200 moving average in the four hour chart. So it's a kind of waiting game was really well outside at the end of uh, the session and uh, uh, therefore yes it doesn't really know where to go at this current stage if you look at the macd it is uh, bearish at this point stochastic is bullish and the rsi is bullish so it's uh, showing different um, different signal but still we're finding significant resistance around this area and uh, at this current stage Due to the fact that demand is most likely going to fall off a cliff in, a, in both in Europe and also in the United States, it's probably more likely that we'll see more downside than upside at this point. But who knows? It's kind of market that is uh, it's really volatile, mainly due to the fact that news is coming out all the time about the Eastern Europe. And if uh, Russia were to cut of uh, energy supply to Europe, then we would see this market just absolutely explode. And yeah, it's just a matter of fact, basically of waiting. It's the middle of the bullish band that most likely will, uh, in the daily chart, be the thing that breaks the market. Breaking below 6.47, that opens the door all the way down to the 50 moving average at 5.45, and then all the way down to the 200 moving average at 4.8. So, hope you find this helpful. If you want to support the channel by subscribing, hit the like button, the bell button to see our new videos, and good luck again. Thank you very much.